It's 1.39. I haven't even started the upload of Tool Time Tuesday, which I was hoping to film early this morning. We went away for the weekend. My schedule just goes all crazy. Yeah, I didn't wake up till like 6 o'clock this morning. I wanted to be up by 4.30 so I could get a jump. Anyways, I've got to run to the dump. I've got to get rid of some trash. Then I'm going to come back here and we're going to make some progress on this air compressor. <laughs> I just need to whip into Canadian Tire. I need to pick up some engine oil because my lawnmower is a little low on oil and then also one of my tires went flat. I don't want to have to buy a new tire because there's still a lot of tread on it so I'm just going to try some slime. All right, we got the stuff. Time to go home. Got some motor oil and we got some slime. I'm not gonna do this right now though because when you put this stuff in, it's best to actually move the vehicle around a bit. In this case, my garden tractor, lawnmower. I don't wanna put this in and have it sit. So I think I'm gonna mow the lawn a little later on this evening. And I'll put this in right before I mow the lawn so that it is nice and uh, moves around in there. And this stuff works really, really good. I have full confidence that this is gonna fix the problem and it's so much cheaper than buying a new tire. But for now, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get going on this. I need to go and see what type of scrap metal I have laying around, some measurements. I think I'm gonna put hockey pucks underneath there so that I can, uh, just as a vibration dampener. And then I'm gonna try tacking it to the walls of the sea can here. I'm not sure if that's gonna be the best, but that is what I'm gonna try to do. see there's a lot of oil in the bottom there that has me a little teeny bit concerned I'm just gonna see if any of these might be loose first if, if I tighten a few of these and some of these bolts are really loose then I'll know that's what it is that's the fastest quickest way no I might just need to snug them up a bit and they'll be good to go uh, you know when you're fixing stuff you always start out with the simplest thing first Kind of work your way around the issue from there. That one was loose actually. That one's loose. Loose. Very loose. I should use a torque wrench for this probably. That one's loose. Pretty loose. Yeah, a lot of these were just really loose. I wonder if they just kind of jiggled their way loose or... I'm not saying that is the solution. But that's what we're going to call it for now. Especially this one. This one was really, really loose. And I know I should probably do like a bolt torque pattern, but whatever. Okay, so what we're gonna do, I'm gonna clean this up a bit and get rid of all the oil. That way if I see any oil after it's run for a bit, I'll know it's still leaking. The hope is that it's not gonna leak anymore. Um, this is the air filter. That is gross. Well, I think we're gonna kinda call that good. Make sure it has enough oil in it. Yeah, there's still plenty of oil in there, so that's good. I'm not, I'm not worried about it. I think, I think tightening that up might do the trick. I'll just have to keep checking it. I'm gonna wash down the tank and everything as well, and that way I can see, see any evidence of new oil. So we'll go clean that up, and then we'll uh, get it all put back together.
Okay, so this, this is where it kind of gets a little, well, this is the part I'm not too sure about. Um, got a bracket all done up there, ready to go. We've drilled out our spacers. I don't know where they are. Drilled out our spacers. Now is the part where I'm going to attempt to lift that air compressor and put it onto that stand all by myself. I don't know. This is the part I'm the most nervous about by far. <gasps> if this doesn't actually work, I'll just give my neighbor a call because, well, he's my neighbor and I'm sure they wouldn't have a hard time lifting it up with me. But I want to see if I can do this myself. I'm just, mostly I'm just curious. No, 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 no. I don't, I don't foresee that going very well. Nope. Stand by. Let's see what happens. Here's what we got. Caught on the motorcycle lift. And you get up there. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I went out, I got some help. So uh, me and James, we lifted it up there. It was awesome. Thanks, James. That's cool. That's pretty handy. I was, well, I guess I'm gonna have the pucks under there too, so it'll be one inch higher. I don't think it's too high. There's probably like two, three inches clearance. I don't know if I'm gonna quite have clearance for my welder under here, uh, but I'm gonna try it. But even so, like this, like obviously my, instead of this being here, I mean my welder will get right nice and tight to it, and oh, this this is just good. Uh, I'm really excited about this. <laughs> All right, one of the problems I had when it was mounted on the ground was this thing was obviously like right above the ground and I couldn't get the little lever on there for my drain valve. That is just nastiness. It's also gonna drain this sledge out a lot better when it can come straight down. That's good, okay. Well, as you just heard, that line popped off again. I repaired that thing and um, this was an original part that was in it, it was all busted up. And basically, their compression fittings that was in there was kind of damaged. And so I kind of straightened it out over like the taper of an alignment punch. And that worked for a while, but I just think with all the vibration, you need a really good solid connection there. So I'm gonna have to buy a new, new piece of tubing there. I'm gonna see if I can find the stuff that has the heat sinks on it, but all in all, really happy with the progress we made today. I didn't get the lawnmower tire fixed, but this thing took a little longer than I thought. But it's done, it's there, and it's fantastic. I'm really excited about that. So thanks for joining me today, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching. Cheers. Yeah.